Ladies and gentlemen, and everyone in between, I think it's about time we finish this game. I'm the Spartan King, and welcome to the final episode of Blasphemous. Today, we finish up the Rose Gates, we figure out what Miriam wants, and what uh, that portal leads to, and then we go on to face his holiness Escrivar. Now that we've destroyed all of the penitent statues, I do suspect that something new will happen, and I don't really know what, or if the Rose Gates are going to change things, but we're damn well gonna find out. And of course, that starts with an excessive amount of pain because I hate the Rose Gate with a passion. Ah! Uh, oh! I uh, held the attack button, damn it. No! No! Oh! Okay. No! Oh my god, finally. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, I am scared for the last one of these. Only one more. Now excuse me while I definitely don't Google the location of this. Okay, so it's somewhere in the library. This library is that the- yeah, that's the library, so I just need to look around. Wait, what's that? Oh, right! Yeah, there's vines in the library, aren't there? All right. Well, at the very least, I never have to do that again. That's the wrong direction! Vines? What we got here? Now, this isn't the rose, but it's something. A tibia! Finally, a fucking tibia. Where is that bone room? It's, uh, down there. Okay, we can actually get two things here. Guys, I cannot tell you how long I've been waiting for a fucking tibia, just for it to be right up there. Vines! Hello. Oh, a prey deal. The silvered lung of Dolphos. Bell ball. These are the explodey bitches. I hear the bell! Amber Eye, that's a new one. Bead carefully carved in the shape of an eyeball that appears to glint in the dark. A sacred tree was struck by lightning, but did not suffer any damage. Its resin did not allow the lightning to escape, so it still remains in the amber nucleus, providing great pr protection against electrical attacks. Okay. Aha, and this is the gate? This is the gate. Now before I go make myself miserable trying to do that, We're gonna go figure out what the bone room is. Actually, no, right, we actually have up here to come up too. Why are there so many moving ladders? Oh. Alright, so just a little shortcut. I don't think I was ever gonna use that, but okay. There we go. Time to find the bone room! Yes, hello. A femur. A tibia. And a kneecap. Unless I'm much mistaken, I have all three. A femur. Tibia. Kneecap, yes. Uh. So I have all three of them, I guess. I may... Maybe I need to... Bring them. Maybe I need to bring it to the bone man before it works here. Okay. I've got, like, I think one bone for you, buddy. Yep. The pale brotherhood of the bones is about to be completed. Ye Do not falter now, penitent one. Oh, don't say that. I'm trying to finish this game today. How many bones do I need left? 
four. I don't know where they all are. They're so scattered about. Yeah, I'll try. But no promises. Don't say don't falter. Don't try and appeal to my completionist mindset. Okay. Okay. Shows the illustration of a femur. I have a femur. It's somewhere, but I have it. There, a femur. Get rid of everything and you'll have nothing to lose. Be fervent and you'll have nothing... Be fervent, that is the secret. Oh! Where's that kneecap? I forbid you to move. Get rid of everything and you'll have nothing to lose. Be fervent, that is the secret. Uh, define everything. I'm gonna take off all of these and my rosaries first. I'm gonna hope to not use all my bile flasks, but I will if I need to. Let's try and using the bile flasks. Get rid of everything after all. I think I've... Wait, no, I also have a prayer equipped. I might not need to done that, but I will. Hold on. Uh, is that everything that I could possibly have equipped? Uh, I do have the heart, uh... There's the closest prey to you. Let's just head down there. Let's use all these flasks. Ah, okay. All right. Ooh, I think this is a prayer. Or something. Romance to the Crimson Mist. Uh, prayer, yeah. Prayer to the Sanguine Mist. Fruit of true fervor. Vapors of holy blood emerge from the skin of the penitent one, damaging those who cross them. Burning blood that you breathe through my body. Blood of red wine, blood of black wine. Emerge from my skin, emerge from my bones. What do? That's the wrong button. Alright. So, our blood is vaporizing. Isn't that fun, guys? Alright. Let's put on all our stuff back, and as much as I hate to say it, we're out of things to stall, meaning that next up is the gate. Oh, I didn't know I could execute these ones. Holy shit. Alright, enough stalling. Let's begin with the pain. Great start, me. Great, just tremendous start. Okay, that was my fault. God, I see the lantern. I want to hit it, but I know I can't. I shouldn't. Ah, it's like unfair Mario on crack cocaine. Uh, if I can skip this the way I think I can, it makes me wonder. Oh, come on. Oh my god, that's a huge skip. Ow. 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 Okay, so no, I don't want to go down there. Oh, no! Ow. Don't hit me, please, God. I don't want to die. Please, I'm too pretty. Oh, fuck. Okay. This is the last one. I can do this. It's the last fucking one. And then I never have to do one of these again. Oh. Ow. No, no, no. Okay. What? No! Oh, God! Give me the path of pain over this. At least that has checkpoints. No, I almost made that mistake again. You won't give me that easily, game! You got me that easily. Move. Aha, fuck you, I recovered. 
without casualty. Okay, I saved it. No, I didn't. Okay, that was it though. That was it. I saw the end. I just need to figure out how to navigate that area. Why are you going that way? The finish is that direction. That that way. Move. What are you doing? Why are you doing this so slowly? Come on. You're almost there. Yes. Thank you. Oh my god, finally it's over. It's finally over. I never have to do them again. All right. Miriam, hi. You're you got your fast. Warrior, you have retrieved all the shards. Thank you. Yes, I have. Let us return to the Hall of Mirrors. Are you going to fast travel us there? Let us return to where the crystal lies. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me guess. You're gone? Yeah. Alright, let's go. I am never doing that again. Although I will say that last one was not as bad as some of the others. Or maybe I was just getting really good at those. You know what? I am just so happy that I never, ever, ever have to do that again. All right, here I Miri am. <laughs> eh? Hi. The crystal is complete. It has recovered all its power. Cool. I am ready to depart now. I must return to my land and leave you. Okay. I do not know if we will meet again, faceless warrior. But pray, keep this as a symbol of my gratitude. Yes. Cantina of the Blue Rose. With this Rose. prayer that I grant you, you can invoke a portion of my power. A prayer? Use it wisely, as it is magic that descends from the very shadows. All of that for a Until fucking prayer? Again, warrior. This had better be the best prayer in the fucking game. Oh. All of that work fixing the thing, and you just break it again? <laughs> What is this prayer? Cantina of the Blue Rose, an unwritten prayer that resonates when you hold a violet crystal from a distant land. An oath of friendship allows the, these frontiers to be crossed, invoking Miriam in, from the glass to attack and bewilder the enemies of the Penitent One with her powerful blade, Ethereal Blue. Girl painted in flowers and shades of blue, girl from the looking glass, cloaked in my oath, return to my side, hear my cry, that my eyes might see your night of magic. Oh! And the music changes. Okay, that's cool. I love to just stay. There's no meter up at the top like there is with other prayers. How long does that stick around? At least it's still loading screens. Well, I think this is it. Let's go say hello to Escribar. I love doing that. Take me to the top. All the way to the top. Now may your sword full of guilt with mine of gold collide. Let them hurt and march in procession. I curse you forever in name. I bless you forever in death. What's this doing for me? Oh! That's what that do for me, okay. Next phase, come on, don't waste my you time, Escrobar. Now you see me awoken as the son of the true miracle. Oh. 
Hello again. Let's end this for good. Ah! Yeah, I've got my own giant fuck off laser. Eat it! Oh my god, this just chews through him. That was so easy! <laughs> Bye. Summa Blasphema. That's not it, is it? Anything new to say, dear gracious? You have freed his holiness from his afflicted torment. And now he walks by the old processions on the other side of the dream. The cradle of the grievous miracle, the final relic. The grail of blood and gold that emanated from the forehead of the father as he silently lamented the moment of his blessed twisting. That first relic is here, at the top of the ashen mountain next to the turn throne where his holiness was kissed by a miraculous pain. And now, your final communion with the miracle awaits. Only you would be able to know how much of it has seeped into your guilty heart. I'm not slowing down this time. We're going straight to the fucking top. Path of the Believer. What? to someone took the May culpa from him Godly will of the grievous miracle. That the plans of the miracle are capricious. Penance never ends, but changes, hurts, and condemns at will. There is no place for the penitent one on the other side of the dream. This place is here among us. He is the new father and the last son of the miracle. Recipient of our prayers. So we ended the miracle in a sacrifice of our own self we have ended the miracle it is no longer at least until blasphemous 2 which was announced like yesterday as of recording this after credit scene and thus shall your name be erased under the heavens you
So you took the May Culpa. What is it you intend to do with it? Son of the True Miracle. Let's take a look at this. Alright. Still just a bluer version. I think I prefer Chantress of the Dead, though. Well, wasn't that something? I assume this just spits me back out. Yep. Well, that was quite the game. That was quite the story. And I can't wait to see the story they tell in the next game. Game Kitchen, you truly outdid yourselves with this beautiful game. This is something. I highly recommend this game if you've got the patience to learn because it is a difficult game. I'm not going to say it's not, but it is absolutely worth it. And that's it until the, until the next one comes out and we see what Chrysanta does with the May Culpa. What the next Blasphemous game has in store for us. The Penitent One became a figure of worship. I suppose it does make sense. He freed them from the miracle. And he helped restore Albero. Well, I suppose that isn't necessarily a point if you speedrun this game. <laughs> or just never donate to the confessions box. I am so so excited for the next game, but the next game will come when its time is ready. I hope you all enjoyed Blasphemous. This was an amazing game, and I will see you all next time for whatever that might hold. Bye for now. If only this was the true ending for Custodia. But my penitence is finished. Perhaps it is your time to take up the sword.